Hey yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to your channel. It's your boy Jesse Keegan. And your girl Fanny Longo. And we are Fanny and Jesse. So right about now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do something different. I don't think we've done this before, have we? We've done something like this, but just under a different title. Yeah, so uh, today we're gonna do uh, what we call the vision board. I think everybody knows what a vision board is. A vision board is something that you uh, think that you actually want to do and uh, you feel like by writing it down it's gonna give you more more like what do you call this more manifestation or something like that. Yeah like it's gonna give you more of uh, like I really want this thing to happen. Like you see it, you visualize. Yeah you visualize it actually. You just fix it by itself, like it's just surface plan, so vision board. Mm -hmm. So like today we're gonna talk on what's on our vision board and I feel like these are things that we put down and we want them to happen this year or we even or even uh the coming years and stuff like that. So this is our vision board right here. It doesn't look all you know nice. This is what uh, there's too much light, yeah there this is what it is. You can see the writings down there. You can see the background is me and her and the lady uh, acting all cozy and stuff like that. So uh, this is a vision board actually. It doesn't have to be a cardboard. It doesn't have to be you know just. It can be anything. <laughs> it can be you yeah. Can it can be anything. You can even anything. can even write it down anywhere. But make sure. Better your words. Yeah, but make sure when you wake up in the morning, it's like something that you actually see it first or maybe if you have an office somewhere you can just put it right there next to your laptop your pc or whatever thing that you normally see it like you, you normally like frequently visit every day even in your shop even in your toilet or something <laughs> so um today we're gonna talk about our vision board and i, I mean yeah we're gonna talk about the vision board and what we want to achieve and what we really uh, want to achieve like on a hundred percent level and the ones that we want to do on long term and whatnot you know we're gonna talk about it right here so what are we gonna start with so one of the things that on our vision board is to stop procrastinating on projects yep procrastination is really really a disease I'm not, for I'm not this lying. one I feel like we're always sleeping on ourselves we get, we can sit down, have ideas, say, let's do this, let's start doing this, or should I say, or invest in something. We find ourselves not doing what we want to do. Then at the end of the True. day, at the end of the day, we find that when we have less time, that's when we want to put in our energy into that thing. Um, what do you call like? We do procrastinate a lot of things. And actually, you know, pro pro procrastination is a disease and it's something that is really, really bad. Like, you shouldn't procrastinate anything that you want to do. We have a ton of ideas in our head, but what we do is we keep on saying, like, are we going to do it tomorrow? Are we going to do it next week? We're going to do it. At the end of the day, you oh, end up forgetting. Too much time. Yeah. At the, yeah. Actually, you think, like, you have so much time, but in the actual sense, you don't have time. We don't have time. So we end up, like, you know, pushing it to next week and the consequence is like we end up forgetting what we actually had like the idea or even like um, one of the best best ideas for example but i mean we don't end up like just forgetting everything we normally put things down the only thing that really kills us is just the procrastination we, i can show you I think we're fond of making excuses. Yeah, excuses. Like we can show you yeah, like a whole let's a do whole this tomorrow. Uh, it's cold, let's do this, I'm busy doing this. Like we can decide to sit down and write down things, uh, like write down everything and put it in place. But the problem is how to even start doing it or something like that. I think it's because of the how? Hmm? Is it or not start doing something or I think it's even how to start it. Or no not how to start but uh, the time. I feel it's the time because I don't know yeah so I mean like for this year and the rest of the years that are coming we're gonna like we need to stop procrastination like, like procrastinating we need to keep ourselves doing things and not like pushing each and every project 
ahead of us and stuff like that. Okay, so next on our list is uh, more time. Oh, we call it like us time, like me and my lady right here. I feel like we don't have more of our time. Like more of our time is consumed in our work, like whatever we do. Like for example, like we can we we are we are doing something right now, yeah, and we are together. I feel it's consuming our time. Another thing is like when uh, when probably we are sitting down watching a movie. I don't know if that is, uh, I don't know if that's our last time. I don't know. Maybe it's our last time, but we need time to reflect on ourselves like me and her probably just go somewhere walk take a walk maybe just go somewhere in a mountain on the mountain and just you know talk about things and you get it like i'll be everybody understands what i'm talking about i feel it can mean different things to people the third thing on our board is vision board is uh eating more this one is just for me is it, does it apply to you as well no i think i'm good when it comes to eating Eating more and finishing my food. I mean, when I was younger, I would eat. I still eat, but then you find that when I go out, I never finish eating my food at all. So that's my goal this year to learn how to finish eating my food. Not no, I think away. going out and not finishing your food. I think that's something that it's so. It's with the ladies. It's with the ladies. I mean, carry anything home. Look, there's something that you're forgetting here. Being younger and what you are right now those are two different things you get it when you're young your conscience is totally different from what you are right now you can eat anything everything at that particular moment and finish it but right now since your conscience is like ah okay let me act this let me act what not <laughs> let, <laughs> let me act, act in front of you let me no i, I don't know probably <laughs> you know i mean i mean Come on, man! All the ladies out there, I don't know what's That's the what problem. Do you think Why do you? In front of you? For what reason? How many times have I finished my food in front of you? How many times have you finished? How my many food? times are you chew as if? I you have know what's no funny? Manners. You know what's funny? She finishes all the food here at home, but when we go out, out, That's what she I'm doesn't saying. finish. You know something really funny? I really realize is this, Mimi. Uh, is, is that is that you will say like I'm really hungry. Let's go eat something or maybe we just be walking in, in town or whatever place we are and we're like Let's just go and eat She's the one who initiates the the whole thing like let's go and eat Not all the time. No, but she normally do that all the time most Okay, most of the, of the time. time But when we get to the place like the restaurant and stuff like that when we start eating Trust me. She doesn't finish the food. She end up she ends up packing and carrying it at home. I'm like, what's the point? But <laughs> here at home, no, but she like the plate. No, but the food at home and forget it in the fridge and I have to throw it. Exactly. That's really bad actually. That's what I'm trying to stop. I'm saying. Exactly. Stop that. I need to learn to finish eating from the restaurant. You should, you, should, you should emulate yourself when you're eating from here, from home. But I feel it's just with the ladies. Mm. <laughs> you feel that. <laughs> I don't know. Eating in public is really. Eating <laughs> what in public? I think, I think, but I this should be with the no. ladies. Any anyway, ladies my out food there? Once in a while. I mean, anyway, okay, ladies out there, just trying to finish your food. And okay, this is for her. Probably she wants to do that. She wants to be finishing food. Or maybe you think what I feel shy for the Turkish people that are around. Not us. even feeling shy, maybe this is, just this is eat. My thing. Just eat. Do they eat? I eat some of yours, I eat mine. And I'm, I'm just saying, finish your food instead of packing. You know, That's it's not good goal. to pack our food, small amount of food, and come with it at home. And then she normally forgets Onto it in the, the fridge and it just looks so weird. For the next on our vision board is uh, a video a day keeps viewers happy. I mean, this is this comes in as a way of consistency. Like, we are not consistent enough when it comes to posting. When it comes to posting, I feel I feel like uh, this one should not apply only for our YouTube channel. This one should also apply on our daily lives. You get it? For example, <clears throat> for example, you want to do something, and if you start doing that thing, you should actually apply it like each and every day. To each and everything you do. Exactly, uh, consistency is the key. Trust me. Video part of it, like we are. Uh, we have a, of course, you see us in, 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 uh, in the, in the